Hi there, folks. Um, there's a wonderful bit in the uh, in the Anglican liturgy of the um, communion of the Lord's Supper, the meal that Christians uh, enjoy, so that they can remember Jesus' sacrifice for them. In the words around that that are used in in the Anglican Church in the, in the, in the Church of England, um, there's this little section called the comfortable words. The comfortable words. And uh, th these are words of comfort for us, um, particularly for that time when we gather um, to take bread and wine. Obviously, we're not able to do that at the moment, but they're, they're wonderful words of comfort um, for everyone, for, for all times and all situations. And uh, this is how uh, they, they start. Someone says, hear the words of comfort our Saviour Christ says to all who truly turn to him and then we get a series of uh, bible verses that's all they are they're just bible verses uh, for our uh, encouragement and our comfort so what's the first one well the first one today uh, is taken from matthew chapter 11 verse 28 and it says come to me all who labor and are heavy laden and i will give you rest those are jesus words to anyone who's wearied and burdened, come to me and I will give you rest. And especially what Jesus has in mind there is a spiritual rest. Because he knows that when we come to him, all of the burden of trying to perform and trying to be make ourselves right with God and trying to make ourselves right with other people and just that pressure to perform and achieve and all of that in a spiritual sense. Uh, is is taken away as we find rest in Jesus we find forgiveness and grace and love in and through Jesus we find a spiritual rest as he goes on to say a, a rest for your souls why because Jesus is gentle and humble in heart and his burden is light so hear these comfortable words these words of comfort today and find rest for your soul in Jesus.